a 383 flat top, 383 AFR heads. Number 114 from Enrico Fonseca. It's a California Impala SS. Assembly today. <laughs> All right, moment of truth, here's one. It's number three that is not clearanced enough. And uh, that's why I do what's called a mock-up. There has been no main bearing clearance uh, measurements. I haven't measured rod bearing clearance. I've Basically, I'm mocking it all up, putting everything in, in case I see the clearance things. Those are just done by hand where I clearance the bottom of the block and I put all the crank rods, pistons and see if it's clearance enough. Here's one right here. Number three needs a little more grinding. So I'll mark that. Everything will get taken apart. That area will be ground some more. The block will be cleaned, a final cleaning and then final assembly of the short block. Carla Wine, take care. Hey again, Carl Owen here, Elwin Engines. Did you ever wonder how much you have to clearance at the bottom of a block? Stroker clearance, it's called, it, well, I'll use a, a drill bit that's like this, or a grinding bit. So many good tools nowadays, you know, these uh, Milwaukee tools. Um, this has already been ground, but that, Use this as a reference, about that much. It's in the same spot at every, every um, bottom of the cylinder. Okay, then down in this area, this gets ground away so that the rod can swing through there, you know, when it's swinging through. And in that area, Looks like nothing for this back one. All right. Also, the other, the other side, don't forget. There and there. So here I marked spots that needed more. So I needed to go wider here. I needed to go wider there. That's it in a nutshell. I just wanted to show you the bottom of the block, the area that gets clearanced. Just did that one-handed. It's not the tools nowadays. They're so good quality.